Hey guys, welcome to Frank's Tech Help from beautiful Waikiki in Honolulu, Hawaii. Today I'm going to be showing you how to plug in your PC connection um, into your Mac for recording other purposes. Um, now this takes into consideration that you already have a DC60 Plus for your Mac and that your computer has an S-Video output. Um, just to show you real quick, on the PC side you will want to activate your um, TV out function. Let me go ahead and jump into full screen here. Um, I'm using ATI Catalyst uh, Center here, so I can activate the output of my um, S-Video as a TV connector, okay? And that's what you'll want to do, basically. You can set it up. Um, I have my resolution set at 1024 by 768. You can play around this uh, with this to get various resolutions. Um, now with the S-Video connector you're going to get um, a much better quality. Um, if, you, if you go through the composite connector, now this, this line's coming out of my computer and going directly into the S-Video of the uh, DC60 Plus. You can purchase if you have, um, if you want to, should happen to want to go from S-Video to RCA um, composite, you can purchase one of these off of eBay or Radio Shack. Um, you can get them on eBay for a few dollars or Radio Shack for like eight to ten bucks. Um, but if you do this, your quality is going to suffer because it is going to uh, RCA connection. Um, so the best bet is that if you have an S-Video, uh, just plug an S-Video cable and go directly into your DC60. And uh, what purpose does this serve? That's a good question um, because the quality is not that great. Um, let me flip back over to my Windows system here. Um, as you can see, the quality is not that great, so you'll have to kind of uh, play around with it, tweak the system. But if you're doing instructional videos, um, stuff like that, then this is a helpful, um, kind of a helpful item. So as you see, you have uh, Google and various other applications that you can run break back out of the out of my window here and figure out which mouse I'm trying to use. Okay, so um, you could also run this in reverse if you happen to have a DC60, um, which I have laying around here somewhere. Anyway, you can run your DC60 into your PC and reverse this application if you want to come out of the MacBook and run directly into a DC60 into PC you'll be able to record your Mac video screen, uh, do a screen capture onto the PC itself. So this is a pretty simplified setup. You just have to make sure that your television output is set up on your PC through your Windows uh, XP preferably. Um, so this output will run directly into the DC60 Plus, directly into the Mac. And uh, of course this is using video glide capture as usual. And then you'll open up video glide and go into the digitizers window and this will bring up your window. Now, when this window is in the foreground, you can go to record, choose video settings, and you can tweak the image, uh, sharpness, contrast, brightness, to get in, um, in order to get a better picture output um, through your Mac there. So anyway, I uh, um, hope this video was helpful. If it was, please post a comment. If it wasn't, then poke my horn. And as always, I hope you guys have a good day. Peace, thank you.